I guess the other thing I would say about the finances, you know, we talk about keeping track and things. You also want to use your finances to budget and look ahead at what your business is going to be. So you just want to basically at the start of the year, either on like a monthly basis or doing it for the whole year or quarterly, you just want to be looking at um, yeah, all of your expenses. So listing out everything you think you might spend and all the money you think you might make, basically, um, just for the whole year, just to get a uh, look ahead at what you think your business. And then you basically compare your performance. Um, so you can look back, you know, your historical um, figures will let you look back at how your business is done. But it's really important to look ahead and see if you can use your um, projections. So you would look at how much money you, you think you're going to make and how much money you think you're going to spend to see where your business is going and then track it. You could maybe do some market research. Um, you could think about your capacity. So say you're selling a product, like if you've got a machine that can make, I don't know, a thousand products a month, you could start at a thousand and work out like, it's really hard to say like what you think is reasonable and maybe start, I mean, super low at the start. If you work in industry, it's going to be easier because you can work out like how many clients you think you might have. Um, it will be easier as you go along. Um, but, you know, if you have overheads to meet, for example, you have certain costs, you might want to look at how many sales you think you have to make it a minimum to cover your overheads, um, you know, your insurance or your rent or something. Um, and it is very hard to say that at the start because you have no idea. And maybe you get stuck in it at the start and within a few months you look at how many you've made and, you know, how many you think it might be foreseeable to, you know, ramp up to in the future.